Next unit of computing is a small form factor computer case designed by Intel. The NUC has had eight generations so far, spanning from Sandy Bridge-based Celeron CPUs in the first generation through Ivy Bridge-based Core i3 and i5 CPUs in the second generation to Gemini Lake-based Pentium and Celeron CPUs and Kaby Lake-based Core i3, i5, and i7 CPUs in the seventh and eighth generations. The NUC motherboard measures 4 times 4 inches, 10.16 times 10.16 centimeters. The barebone kits consist of the board in a plastic case with a fan, an external power supply, and a Visa mounting plate. Intel does sell just the NUC motherboards, which have a built-in CPU, although as of 2013, the price of a NUC motherboard is very close to the corresponding cased kit. Third-party cases for the NUC boards are also available. Topic: <laughs> First generation Sandy Bridge This UCFF motherboard and system kit are codenamed Ski Lake DCP847SK and Deep Canyon DCCP847DY respectively. Topic: Second Generation Ivy Bridge The base UCFF motherboard and kit without Thunderbolt or USB 3 are codenamed Golden Lake DC3217GK and Ice Canyon DC3217IY respectively. The Thunderbolt-capable UCFF motherboard and kit are codenamed Campers Lake DC3217CK and Box Canyon DC3217BY, respectively. The USB 3-capable UCFF motherboard and kit are codenamed Rend Lake D53427RK and Horse Canyon DC53427HY, respectively. The stripped-down DC3217BY model has a signature red top cover and no Ethernet. This model, while stocks were still available, generally sold for a deep discount. The absence of Ethernet may be mitigated by using a USB 2.0 to 10/100 fast Ethernet dongle based upon the Kawasaki LSI-1 chip adapter KL5K USB 102, for example, or a similar dongle based upon a Realtek chip. The Kawasaki Logic dongle requires a proprietary driver for Mako's X, whereas the driver for the Realtek dongle is built into Mako's X. The DC3 217BY runs Mako's BY 10.9 and any of its updates flawlessly as the processor's HD4000 is fully supported by Mako's X sound is not provided by the basic chassis but may be provided by a generic USB dongle C media for example MDP to SVGA or HDMI to SVGA adapters with integral audio output jack can be made to work for audio output with the appropriate updates to the DSDT. Topic: <laughs> Third generation. Topic: Bay Trail M This UCFF motherboard DN2820FYB and system kit DN2820FYKH model were codenamed Forest Canyon. The DN2820FYKH product itself is mismarked DN2820FYK, but the retail package, all retail documentation, and Intel's website correctly identify this product as DN2820FYKH. The 
H indicates support for internal 2.5 media SSD or HD. There is no non-H version of this product as it does not include an onboard MSATA connector, hence media which is external to the board is mandatory, and hence the H version. This product introduces for the first time a new 12-volt, 3-ampere wall wart in place of the traditional 19-volt, 3.42-ampere power brick and its Mickey Mouse AC power cord. Four region-specific plug-on adapters, including North America and three overseas countries, are included in the retail package. These models shipped with the problematic BIOS Revision 13, however this revision did not recognize most low-voltage SO DIMMs and would report as having zero capacity. Keyboard escapes for BIOS interfacing had been problematic, legacy booting was not supported, and it had been elected to only include UEFI booting. BIOS Revision 48 has been released and resolved the problems, enabling the recognition of most low-voltage SO DIMMs, keyboard escapes and legacy booting. <laughs> Bay Trail I This UCFF motherboard DE3815 TYB and system kit DE3815 TYK models were codenamed Thin Canyon. Topic: <laughs> Fourth generation. Topic: <laughs> Haswell UCFF motherboard D34010 WYB and D54250 WYB and system kit D34010 WYK D34010 WYKH and D54250 WYK D54250 WYKH models were designated Wilson Canyon containing Haswell processors were revealed in June 2013 Topic Fifth Generation Topic Broadwell U In early 2015 a new generation of NUCs, powered by fifth-generation Intel processors was released and in Q2 2015 the first NUC with Core i7 processor NUC 5i7RYH will become available. The currently available collection of fifth generation of NUCs include Adaptive, Smart Performance Technology and Turbo Boost Technology 2.0. UCFF motherboard NUC 5i3 RYB, NUC 5i5 RYB and NUC 5i7 RYB and system kit NUC 5i5 RYK, NUC 5i3 RYH, NUC 5i5 RYK, NUC 5i5 RYH and NUC 5i7 RYH models were designated Rock Canyon. UCFF motherboard NUC 5i3 MYBE and NUC 5i5 MYBE and system kit NUC 5i3 MYHE and NUC 5i5 MYHE models were codenamed Maple Canyon. All models include dual channel DDR3L so DIMM 1.35 volts 1333 1600s of a megahertz 16 gigabytes maximum 1 gigabit ethernet port internal support for M.2 either B keyed Maple Canyon or M keyed Rock Canyon 22 times 42 22 times 60 and 22 times 80 SSD card supporting PCIe 2.0 times 1 times 2 and times 4 and SATA 6 gigabits per second 
Two USB 3.0 connectors on back panel Two USB 3.0 connectors on front panel Two internal USB 2.0 ports via header Up to 7 one surround audio via mini HDMI and mini display port headphone microphone jack on the front panel topic <laughs> Braswell these UCFF system kit NUC5 CPYH and NUC5 PPYH models formerly known as Pinnacle Canyon are based on 5th generation Celeron and Pentium branded Braswell 14 nanometers processor family there is also the UCFF complete system NUC5 PGYH model formerly known as Grass Canyon which is based on 5th generation Pentium branded Braswell 14 nanometers processor family and comes with 2 gigabytes of RAM and 32 gigabytes of eMMC with Windows 10 installed All models include one memory channel DDR3L so DIMM 204 pin 1.35 volts 1333 1600 of a megahertz 8 gigabytes maximum 1 gigabit ethernet port 802.11 AC Wi-Fi Intel Wireless AC3165 and Bluetooth 4.0 Internal support for M.2 E keyed 22 times 30 wireless card supporting PCIe 2.0 times 1 and USB 2.0 2 USB 3.0 connectors on back panel 2 USB 3.0 connectors on front panel 2 internal USB 2.0 ports via header up to 7.1 surround audio via HDMI Headphone – microphone jack on the front panel Headphone – toslink jack on the rear panel SDXC slot with us I support on the side Circle sensor According to the Intel technical product specification, these models have fans. Topic: Sixth generation. Topic: <laughs> Skylake U. UCFF System Kit NUC6I3SYK, NUC6I3SYH and NUC6I5SYK, NUC6I5SYH models were designated Swift Canyon, containing Skylake processors. UCFF System Kit NUC6I7KYK models were codenamed Skull Canyon, containing Skylake processors. All models include dual channel DDR4 so DIMM 1.2 volts 2133 MHz 32 gigabytes maximum 1 gigabit ethernet port Intel dual band wireless AC8260 802.11 AC 1 times 1 up to 867 megabits per second Dual mode Bluetooth 4.1 Internal support for M.2 M keyed 22 times 42 and 22 times 80 SSD card supporting PCIe 3.0 times 1 times 2 and times 4 and SATA 6 gigabits per second SDXC slot with us I support on the side Intel HD Graphics 540 video 580 for the NUC 6i7KYK Up to 7.1 surround audio via full-sized HDMI and mini display port Intel Wireless Display Intel Witty Skull Canyon models include 
USB-C port supporting USB 3.1 Gen 2 SuperSpeed Plus, Thunderbolt 3 and DisplayPort 1.2 Internal support for a second M.2 M keyed 22 times 42 and 22 times 80 SSD card supporting PCIe 3.0 times 1 times 2 and times 4 and SATA 6 gigabits per second. Topic: <laughs> Apollo Lake. These UCFF system kit NUC6CAYS and NUC6CAYH models formerly known as Archer's Canyon are based on the 6th generation Celeron branded Apollo Lake SOC 14 nanometers processor family. RAM DDR3L-1600 and 1866 1. 35 volts so DIMM Topic Seventh Generation Topic Kabi Lake U Baby Canyon Intel 7th generation NUC models, codenamed Baby Canyon, are based on their Kabi Lake U processors. Topic: Kabi Lake U, Dawson Canyon. A refresh of the seventh-generation NUC models, codenamed Dawson Canyon, saw a replacement of the USB 3.1 Type-C port with a second HDMI 2.0 a port. This refresh also updated the CPUs in the i5 models while still using Kabi Lake U processors, and the i7 models to Kabi Lake R processors. The i3 models saw no change in the CPU. Intel Optane M.2 support remains, but no models with a pre-installed module were released. M.2 support was updated from a single 22 times 42 80th slot to dual 22 times 30 key and 22 times 80 key M slots. Topic: <laughs> Kabi Lake R, Dawson Canyon. Topic Gemini Lake The UCFF system kit NUC7PJYH and NUC7CJYH models, codenamed June Canyon, based on 7th generation Pentium and Celeron branded Gemini Lake SOC 14 nanometers processor family. RAM, DDR4-2400-1. 2 volts so DIMM. Topic Eighth Generation Topic Kabi Lake G Intel 8th generation NUC models, codenamed Hades Canyon, is based on their Kabi Lake G processors with a TDP from 65W to 100W. It features a custom AMD GPU, based on Vega and Polaris technologies. Topic: <laughs> Coffee Lake U Intel 8th generation NUC models, codenamed Bean Canyon, is based on their Coffee Lake U processors with a TDP of 28W. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Canon Lake U. Intel 8th generation NUC models, codenamed Crimson Canyon, is based on their 10 nanometers Canon Lake U processors. They come with Windows 10 Home X64 pre-installed along with a 1 terabyte SATA3 HDD. Topic: Reception and ecosystem. 
The NUC was seen by some reviewers as Intel's response to or adoption of the Apple Mac Mini format, although it is actually smaller, physically. Given its kit nature, other reviewers have seen it as a more powerful Raspberry Pi, particularly since the NUC boards could be bought without a case. The NUC can also be seen as an extension or continuation of Intel's earlier mobile on desktop mod initiative that was spearheaded by Oppen as early as 2004. Most of the third generation NUCs come in two case sizes, one with room for a 2.5 inch drive, and one without. The smaller case, although lacking room for a 2.5, drive, still has an internal SATA connector including SATA power. Some larger third-party cases have appeared that can fit such drives, the Intel case is actively cooled with a fan. Silent PC Review notes that the original Intel NUC had the distinction of being the quietest fan cooled mini computer we've come across, the NUC D54250WYK Haswell based, with the same cooling system, sounds exactly the same. In normal use, you can't hear the fan until your ear is inches from the unit. Nevertheless, passively cooled third party cases have appeared on the market as well. Larger or metallic third-party cases provide lower operating temperatures as well. A review by the Tech Report of the pre-production 2012 vintage NUC found that the NUC would seize up after a few gigabytes were transferred over wireless and that the problem could be alleviated by better cooling of the NUC case. Intel later increased the default fan speed for production machines through a BIOS update downloadable from Intel's website for early adopters. Regarding power consumption, in their review of the D54250WYK with a Haswell i5-4250, Silent PC Review concluded that an idle power level of just 6W and typical use power barely into two digits is very impressive in one sense, in another sense, it's what you find in current Ultrabooks using similar components." Other companies have subsequently adopted a form factor similar, but not identical, to Intel's NUC. For example, Gigabyte Technology launched their BRICS series, which attempts to differentiate itself using more powerful components, up to the i74770R processor, which embeds Intel Iris Pro graphics. <laughs> <laughs> Operating system support NUCs support UEFI-compatible operating systems, such as Microsoft Windows, as well as most distributions of Linux. Additionally, they can be used for vertualization with VMware vSphere. Multiple NUCs can be used together to create a home lab for learning purposes. It is technically possible, with some limitations in functionality, to install an unauthorized copy of Makos on a NUC, creating a Hackintosh. The pre Haswell Core i3 and Core i5 NUCs will run OS by 10.9 Mavericks well. Skylake and Broadwell based NUC is also a supported device in Google Fuchsia OS. <laughs> <laughs> 